Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. Today I show you how to make cold brew at home as simple making and everyone can do it. Step 1. I pour over roasted beans, the coffee I use today. It is coffee from Vietnam, area of Khe San, Quang Tri Province. The score of SCA is 84.5, so it is called specialty coffee. What is SCA? SCA is the Specialty Coffee Association of America. The term specialty coffee or specialty coffee is used to refer to coffee that is graded 80 points or above on a 100-point scale by a certified coffee taster, SCAA, or by a licensed Q grader, CQI. Coffees scoring 80-plus points are classed as specialty coffees, and those ranking at 95 points or higher are seriously swanky premium coffees. Any coffees scoring 80-plus points are guaranteed to come from ethical sources, where human rights and the environment are respected and farmers and workers get a good deal. Step 2. I use the manual coffee grinder to transfer from beans to ground. Now I tell you in quickly, what is cold brew? Cold brew coffee, also called cold water extraction or cold pressing, is the process of steeping coffee grounds in water at cool temperatures for an extended period. Coarse ground beans are soaked in water for about 12 to 24 hours. I will tell you the history cold brew. Cold brew coffee originated in Japan, where it has been a traditional method of coffee brewing for centuries. Slow drip cold brew, also known as a process in which water is dripped through coffee grounds at room temperature over the course of many hours. The formula that I use that is 50G about 1.764 ounces with 500 milliliters water. Step 3. Pour water into the bowl first and later then coffee ground. Use the spoon and start stirring around to mix up the composite. Because the ground coffee beans in cold brewed coffee never come into contact with heated water, the process of leaching flavor from the beans produces a chemical profile different from conventional brewing methods. Step 4. I use the food wrap film type to cover the bowl and put it down to the fridge about 120 hours, 5 days. Now it is 10.46 a.m., June 7, 2023. After 5 days, spending 120 hours in cold temperature, I take it out of the fridge and start the step 5. Now it is 10.47 a.m., June 12, 2023. I start the step 5 with a glass jar. I put on it a food fabric filter coffee. 
Step 5. Open the bowl and now I start to pour coffee liquid into glass jar. The fresh liquid goes through. The ground stays back with food fabric filter coffee. Coffee beans contain a number of parts that are more soluble at higher temperatures, such as caffeine, oils, and fatty acids. However, brewing at a lower temperature for 24 hours results in higher caffeine content when brewed in equal volume compared to 6 minutes at 98 degrees Celsius, 208 degrees Fahrenheit. The pH of cold and hot brew coffee is similar, but cold brew coffee has a lower titratable acid concentration. Both pH and titratable acidity influence taste. Step 6. I take some cube ices and place them in the glasses to enjoy the cold brew homemade by myself. Then I take one glass is cold brew coffee, and another one I add some fresh milk, and I have a milk cold brew coffee. This is my experiment about making cold brew specialty coffee at home, and hope you will enjoy when are watching this. Please subscribe my channel and leave your comments if you love to. Goodbye, this is Wind on Cloud Channel, a place for experiment about travel and coffee. Thank you and see you in my next videos.